because as that shell builds up in mass, it's also acting like a snowplow, plowing up all the stuff in the interstellar medium in front of it. The stuff that's there anyway as bystanders. Is going to get mowed over and is going to be incorporated into that and super so shell. shell. So there should be a super duper shell nah. around it, and we've just found it. Oh! Yay! He you buried heard, the lead! What? You heard it here. What? So we've been using a gorgeous new, not expensive telescope. Oh. The kind of telescope that so-called amateurs use, refracting telescopes. Six of them bolted together in parallel. And we stared at T. Corona Borealis for about a hundred hours. They're not in darkness for a hundred hours. I just want to make that clear. No. Oh, no. okay. Right, right. <laughs> yeah. They get the, the dark stuff tonight. Right. They close the hatch. Yeah. And, and then tomorrow night. Pick it up again. We're back at it. Okay. Back at it. Okay. Right. Go. 